Do you see? So they are the key of B. So I'm going to be doing this in the key of C. I'll do this in the key of because the progression is simple. I'll do it on C. C sharp, F, F sharp, B G, and A flat. All right. So what are they doing here? Um, okay. So the progression is. Playing um, four chord, four chord, one chord, five, three, back to four chord. You see? Then along the line, while playing, you can use this idea of um, your relative minor. Uh, you can play your line instead of playing the do. Whenever you are repeating the song again, you can just play loud. You see? That's in the key of B. So let's go to the key. In the key of C. So what he was playing there was um, okay. Let me see. I think I have. Do I have a loop here that I can play? I don't think I have a loop here. But let's just go ahead with it. I don't have a loop here that I can play for us. But I just get the progression. So. Service is still going on, so I'm I'm actually bringing videos like this on my channel. I just hope YouTube does not strike the video of copyright. So I'm bringing videos like this because I want you guys to see how these chords are applied or how these plays are utilized, like live. I want you to see live. I, I want to give you something that you can go to church and apply, like just apply it. When testimony is going on, maybe like a worship build up, like it's like a talk music, also, you know, it's like a talk music. At the point, the drummer will really bring down his drum, then your parts can come in. Let me bring in my part here. I'm using an analog part. So that's it in the key of um, in the key of C. That's the progression. Four chord, one chord, five chord, three chord, back to four chord. You see, that was always playing the key of C. So let's take the same thing to the key of C sharp. But it's an easy progression. This is something that you can just get. Then you can be playing around with some other things. Dun, dun, four chord. You see, and add it whenever that kind of music is being played. So the tutorial will not be long because I'll give you the code and I show you where they use it. Then if you want me to make that same beat or that loop for you, I can try and make the loop for you so that whenever you are playing, or you can tell your drummer this is what I want. You can count for your drummer like this is what I want. So let's go to C or key of C sharp. So you have a three, four, six chord, five chord, three, four. That's it. All true.
can be creating melodies for the progression. I have a three, four. You see, I'm creating melodies. Just come up with anything you want to create. That's it. They're in the key of. Then to show it in the key of F. No, let's let us let us not go there because the progression is too easy. <laughs> Just to show it. Four chord. One chord. Five chord. Three. Four. That's in the key of F. Alright, so it's actually a very, very, very short tutorial. See you guys in another one. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Tell your friends about the channel, like I told you guys before. It is the support that kind of helps this channel grow. Alright, so let's round up with the same progression. It was in the key of B. Let's just play through. 